All right, everybody, thanks for coming. Thanks for coming. I brought you guys here to talk about some pressing issues uh, that the public needs to be aware of. Abuse of rice. Abuse of rice is not acceptable in these islands. Locals were born into rice. Some people were born in bags of rice. Okay, so don't, don't mess around with rice. My ancestors long ago created the rice cooker to specifically cook rice. God damn it, use a rice cooker. If you put them in one pot, you gotta take the extra attention. You gotta watch them boil. You gotta stop them. It's like they're trying to solve a problem that has already been solved uh, by the Japanese people. R-I-C-E, yeah? Rice, ingredient, cook, electric, yeah? Not rice, ingredient, cook, a pot. People are just all over rice with cauliflower rice, broccoli rice. No, no, sweetheart, it's called hinode, chachachi chichachi, the white bag with the crane. Yeah? The only acceptable substitution to white rice is uh, brown rice, yeah? Because uh, brown rice matters. You know, there is no really acceptable for me substitution for rice, yeah? I think the next one would be air. Sometimes people run out of rice. How is that even possible? How is that possible to run out of rice, bro? And if you own a restaurant in Hawaii and you do not serve rice, close your business, because that is wrong. That is wrong. No one's going to come. Even shave ice. Shave ice looks like rice with syrup. I was taught that the more you love the person, the more you wash the rice, yeah? When you don't wash the rice at all, that's, that's like a you, yeah, with your rice, yeah, and we need to be saying I love you with the rice. Wash them, like that, just like that, you see that, you see that action, like that, wash them. Love me that shit, talk story with your family while you're loving that shit, why you gotta be so isolated? For me, I like to take a little bit and all the granules and put it in my hand and I go like that and let them fall through. You turn on the water, wash them again, at least three times, and then when you measure your water, plop, plop them in the water. Put, fill up the water right there. I don't know if you noticed when you bought your pot, but it's an indicator right in the goddamn pot. Three cups goes to the number three. If you're Japanese, they do them by eye, yeah? Trust your inner Japanese, yeah? And let that voice tell you when to stop the water. That's how you make perfect rice, yeah? You only get one chance with rice. You gotta treat rice like your life. You only get one chance to live them. If you mess up, just throw your life away, bro.